Welcome, welcome back everybody to Stacklands. Um, I don't have any mods active because I'm on like a vanilla run. Uh, so what I do have to do is select a different save because I was mucking about with some modded stuff on save number two there. All right, moon 83, continue. Now what I want to do is I want to grab my uh, demon sword. You've got that. And then I want to take everyone back and fight another demon. Get another demon sword. I want three. I've got three golden chalices, so it shouldn't be too difficult. There's eating up everything on the island. Thanks for that. Uh, what should we sell? Oh, I've got rid of a bunch of mods, including that quick selling. <laughs> Let's get rid of these things here. And uh, uh, can I get rid of the corpse? No. Let's get rid of the cane sugar. Okay. So we're back over. Treasure chests, golden goblets. Where's my temple? Uh, anyone who doesn't have a helmet? You don't have one. There you go. Right, these guys. Oh, I could probably could have left the builder actually um, over in the in the island. So these are my these are my people. Where's my temple gone? Does the temple get destroyed when uh, you summon the demon? Am I gonna have to make another one? Temple, temple, goblet, goblet. Am I just being dumb? Uh, hmm. If you see the temple, please let me know in the comments because I can't see the flipping thing. Very strange, indeed. Well, well, okay then. <laughs> I guess that's fine. Uh, I want the tiger fur coat on this mage. You don't have anything. You guys are making babies over there. Wow, I've got so many villagers. Uh, all right, let's just make another temple, I guess. Very strange. Uh, five plank, five brick, three iron bar. Iron bars. Let's get some iron ore on the go uh, in the smelter. Oh, I've forgotten how to play the flipping game. I've spent too long playing Citizen Sleeper. Right. Right, let's get you in the lumber camp. Actually, no, let's get you in the lumber camp. Uh, let's, I've got another builder. Let's get you in the quarry. Brickyard. Sawmill. And then I need... Yeah, I'm going to need some wood. Uh, have I got any just, like, lying around anywhere? I do not. But here's a brick, so that's a good start. Alright, wood in the sawmill, please. Stone in the brickyard. You know how this works. And I want these to land on here. It'd be good if you could just assign where they land, you know? Now I want wood in the sawmill. So we've got uh, our three iron bars. Just need two bricks. Uh, sorry, just need a bunch of bricks now. Oh, I've actually got loads of stone. I didn't realise that. That's cool. Planks. Let's uh, put these out all in a handy little line so I can see them doing their thing. We've got three bricks. I could get people adventuring here um, to try and get weapons and stuff, but... I really just want those demon swords, so I'm just focused on that. Maybe not the most efficient use of my time, but I'm just enjoying the process of being back in Stacklands and playing it. Okay, so I don't need any more planks. 
don't need any more bricks either. I suppose I could make better better stuff. Oh, I do need more planks. What am I talking about? Muppet. Let's get smelting this iron ore just anyway. Yeah, planks were the only things that I needed. And I've not got him in the lumber camp. Right, Builder, where are you? Oh, Villager just showed up. Oh, because he was a baby. Right, yeah. Fair enough. I'll pay attention to the temple this time. When uh, when the demon shows up. See if it just gets um, like evaporated. Should be interesting. I suppose I, if that does happen, I do want another temple. So I can get cracking uh, with that. Get these eggs on the stove here. Let's have a tidy up of food production. I've got so many eggs. <laughs> Flipping egg. Flipping egg. I do have a lot more uh, villagers now, though. Okay, so we have everything we need once this plank is made. Feed those villagers. Wow, yeah, that is a lot of villagers. Everyone was fed. Sell seven cards. Uh, I'll just sell the treasure chest, you know. A shaman appeared out of nowhere. Wow. If you want to learn more about visiting the cursed worlds, you can talk to me. Well, I definitely do, yeah. Uh, let's send the warrior. To talk to him. All right, let's get uh, a builder on here, another builder, and um, pop a swordsman on there. We're building a temple. Do you know what? Let's hold off on talking to the shaman for a while. Let's get our temple built first. Uh, what I don't have is like defensive items still, so military. I'd quite like to know how to make like a skull helmet. I wonder what happens if I put like a bone in the smithy with like an iron bar, a gold bar. Yeah, uh, let's just get these people making some raw materials. And I guess we could send some people exploring now. Why not? This mage is a bit weak. Uh, I think maybe we should take his iron shield off and give him the tiger fur coat. I'll give this one the iron shield. There you go. Slightly more, slightly more balanced out. quiver there, but uh, no materials to make a bow. Just pop that on the market. Morning star, 15% chance to stun random enemy. That's actually pretty good. Is that better than the staff of fear? Yeah, because it doesn't reduce the health. Yeah, I don't like the staff of fear too much. It, it reduces the health by way too much. Okay, let's smelt this iron ore. I'm going to see if doing a bone and uh, an iron bar kind of uh, makes a skull helmet, maybe? Nope. Not sure. Hey, you guys, you need to fight this mimic. Don't just stand there. Alright, a key. Excellent. I've learnt to press E to align all my cards now, which is extremely useful. Corey and the Brickyard are overlapping for some reason. Uh, should we get someone in the iron mine? 
Well, no. Let's get everyone ready to fight the demon. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then, oh, the swordsman. This swordsman as well, I want. Oh, no, they can all fight, can't they? Yeah, I forgot about that. Might as well chuck this on one of the villagers then. The quivers don't do anything, but why not? Temple. Oh, okay, yeah, you have, I forgot you have to put the goblet there. Start the ritual. Yeah, okay, so it does It does disappear. Let's chuck even our rubbish villages in there because it's a faction economy. Can we do anything with the shaman? Nope. Alright, let's fight this demon. Let's see if we get another demon sword. I think I had an item that healed everyone. Oh, you're dead. <laughs> Whoops. Let's feed everyone. Really, he is a guest. We should probably fight the demon. Sell eight cards. Uh, I guess I'll just sell some eggs. Start a new moon. Come on, demon. I don't think you're going to survive this. I wonder what that item was that was healing everyone. Maybe uh, maybe I left that on the island or something. This poor villager's got no weapons. Let's give him the Staff of Fear. Can we do that? Yeah. He's probably going to die. Oh, there we go. There's the, there's the heal everyone item. If he survives, I think we'll give this villager the demon, demon sword. Why not? He's got all these status effects on him, look. Maybe I'll just fast forward quickly. Oh, there goes another mage. Whoops. That staff of fear is is, a re is really uh, a liability. No, my builder. Fire cloak. Oh, nice. He killed the demon. What's a fire cloak do? 7% chance to do a critical hit on all enemies. Whoa. Let's give that to... Who's got a powerful weapon? Stun target. Magic broom. Heal all friendlies. Morning star. Stun to chan uh, chance to stun random enemy. Will that stack with the chance to hit everyone, I wonder? So, this could poison all enemies, this could potentially stun all enemies, which is very cool, so I think we'll do that, and then whoever's got the Staff of Fear next, it's a bit of a liability, we'll give them the Tiger Fur Cloak, uh, and then I guess I could make a bow and arrow thing, but I don't really want to. Okay, so I didn't get a Demon Sword, I got um, a Fire Cloak, which is just as cool. So let's make another... Temple. Let's put some put some guys to work here. Lumber camp for you. Uh, I, did, I did lose some people there. Let's just turn them into graveyards and take them out of the equation. Yeah, we'll sell that. Cool. Now I need iron. Let's get someone in the iron mine. You can go in the iron mine. Uh, where is it? There. So much magic dust. <laughs> yeah, I kind of want some ideas for defensive stuff. That's That's kind of where I'm at right now. But I guess what I should do next is have a look at the quests and um, see... Oh yeah, no, the next is going to be meeting the Shaman after I've killed the next demon. I've got some wood here. Look. Cracking, right. Iron ore. Oh, uh, iron ore goes in the smelter. 
feed our villagers. They did some good work there fighting that demon. Sell 18 cards. Uh, Alright, fine. So you sell some eggs, uh, sell some more eggs. I've got so much food, I just never need to worry about it, really. Cool. Uh, right. Five planks. Oh, I took the guy out of the quarry, that was dumb. Uh, iron bar. Need one more brick, one more iron bar. A coin? I didn't want a coin. Oh dear. Silly game. Now, should I send the person wearing the fire cloak? Max health plus 10. Should I send him to the island, maybe? No, uh, let's send both of them so I can take one back. Because if I fight the demon again without the fire cloak, I've got a chance of getting some other cool loot. Maybe another demon sword, that'd be fun. Nom nom nom. Excellent, and who's got the fire cloak? You. So let's send this one back. I've actually got quite a few cool fighters here, looking at it. Alright, sailing off. Just want this iron mine to uh, produce now. What's this militia guy got? A blowpipe. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, let's balance those out a bit. Iron ore, smelter, belter, smelter, helter, skelter. Alright, iron bar, let's get three villagers on there. Yoles can do that. I guess I'll just get everyone producing some random random stuff. You never know if you're going to need it or not. The lumber camp here, let's chuck you in there. I can always just sell it off. I've got so much money now that uh, I don't even need to think about that either. So let's um, fast forward. Doop, 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 doop. Put the stones in the brickyard. Why is the iron mine giving me stone? Is that because I've got a mage in there instead of a builder? Cool. Right. I've got 48 cards too many. Fine. Go on then. Sell. Uh, sell. Sell. <laughs> sell. Still got 32 cards too many. Uh... Oh, flipping egg. I guess we'll just get rid of some of these eggs. Oh, I'm, I'm missing my modded uh, double click, uh, middle click the mouse to sell. That is. Yeah, that is a real quality of life improvement that uh, should be in the base game. Okay, our. 
dude is nearly here. Where's my stove? There it is. Demon man's nearly here. I wish there's a way to like donate coins to the charity or something. That'd be good. Temple. Golden goblet. Start the ritual. Okay, so we're fighting the demon without its own sword or its own cloak. But that's okay. That's something that we were well aware of. Let's see what we can grab off him. Now, some of these, some of these, this crew has got pretty low health, but I do have that healing ability. Before, I had way more villagers and stuff, but they were just dying because they were so weak and I hadn't really armed them up, so it wasn't very nice of me to do that. I don't know where my builder's gone. Nope. No idea. Let's uh, do a fast forward on this. Oh, one of the other mods I was using puts the damage counter in the middle of here. That's um, from Lopi Dav, and uh, that also <laughs> makes a huge difference because you can see how much health is remaining. Oh man, I got stunned by everyone. He's dead. Fire cloak. All right, cool. So I didn't get two swords, but I got two fire cloaks, which is quality. Right, uh, seven percent chance to do a critical hit on all enemies. Perhaps we should give that to. Maybe we should give that to one of the people who've got the. Where's my ship? Um, one of the people who've got the um, sword, the demon sword. Yes, we'll do that. Had a brain glitch there. Let's feed all the villagers. Nom 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 nom. Right. So over on the island here, I'm just going to get my all my people back. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, <laughs> let's pause a minute. Get you back. Uh, I've got a corpse over there for some reason. Pop this on there, this on there. Gold ore. I think that'll do. Oh, sorry, Mackerel, you're on your own, flopping around on the beach. Uh-oh, have I got enough food? All right, all right, okay, I ate some of the stuff that I put on the boat. That's fine. As long as nobody died, that was the main thing. So now we've got the whole crew here. Uh, let's uh, have a look at talking to this shaman. Shaman, shaman. Um, let's put the fire cloak on with the demon sword. So he's going to be our sort of MVP. Who's got a rubbish... Oh. Who's got a rubbish uh, shield? You have. That on there. Right, here we go. Let's talk to the shaman. Oh, it's only one person that does it, right? Okay. Maybe it should be Demon Lord. Where's he gone? Be nice to be able to name them. Oh, I think I saw a thing where you can name them. You can do like naming tag. There he is. Swordsman number one. Chanting. Okay, I wonder what this is going to bring up. Very strange. Idea. Altar. Two brick, two stone, one mage. Okay. Well, I have a mage. I have a stone. I have two brick. What was it again? Two stone I need, right. Let's get the builder in the quarry. Fast forward you, mate. Doink. This is exciting. I wonder what happens when you do that. Fast forward that. Altar. Used for summoning spirits. Okay. The current time, this... Oh, that's the time. Okay. Uh, what happens when you chant again? You get more ideas? Rumor, world of I, world of death, offering raw meat at the altar will summon a spirit. Oh, we definitely got some raw meat. No, we got cooked meat. Um. Uh. 
Raw meat, raw meat, raw meat. Does raw fish work? No. It's got to be meat. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see any. I must have cooked it all. So how are we going to get raw meat? I don't have a cow to kill. Feels a bit macabre. No, we don't. So let's get everyone... Let's get everyone uh, exploring. And see who can kind of summon a an animal. There's a house over there on its own. You go down there, house. See, so maybe if a wolf comes out, I think you get raw meat off wolves. So, feed villagers. No, plenty of cooked meat, look, we've just eaten. Everyone was fed. 42 cards to sell. I should maybe make some more warehouses. Because uh, I've got a lot of food here. Uh, just, just tidy up these coins. Maybe I should make another coin chest or two. But for now, we'll just sell um, all the resources. Sell these two as well. Now that I've got those in my sights, sell flint, sell planks, sell this bone, sell this raw fish that I don't need. Oh man, you know what? I bet you something's going to come up where you have to leave a fish. I'm going to keep one fish there, uh, wherever it is, out of the way. 27 guards to sell. Uh, Right, sell some eggs. <laughs> Maybe I should just kill a bunch of chickens <laughs> because I've just got way too much food, way too many cards. There we go. Oh no, I have to still have to sell stuff. Okay. Start new moon. So we're fighting chickens. There's some raw meat. Cool. Or well, we can get all of this lot. Oh no, something useful might come out of here. That'll be good. Good fun. Right, now we'll take them all out of their adventures. So you're fighting a mimic. Sticks, trash. Iron bar, that could come in useful. Uh, soil, trash. Rock, trash. Boom, boom, boom. There's a rat here. Oh, the builder's in the quarry. That's where he was. Right, let's just give him a shield then. Stop working, man. You're a workaholic. There we go. Fight that mimic. Killed a bunch of chickens. Got a bunch of raw meat. Uh, gonna kill the rat. Cool. So we now have quite a bit of raw meat, which is great. So the altar starts to rumble. Okay. Spirit of death. Wow. I am the spirit of death. Oh, no, I need to do a voice for this. I'm the spirit of death. Can you help me in my world? Help them out. Thank you. Follow me to my world. All right. Mm. <laughs> ah, we've got a new world. Visit the world of death. Sweet. Life is short. Open this pack to get cards. Animal cage. Cow. A grapevine. Tree. Villager. Curse of death. Spirit of death. Welcome to the world of death. Every few moons our villagers grow up. After turning old we pass away. Oh, okay, so it's like a um, an age modifier. We can also get sick if there's too much poop around. Can you lift our curse? Heck yeah, I will do my very best. So I have an animal cage. Let's put the cow in there to get milk. Let's put this guy in here to get food. Uh, and... The curse of death. So, death but no taxes. Villagers grow old and get sick. I'm going to pop this right in the middle so that I never forget about it because I'm 
likely to forget. Let's uh, let this go. So I need money, which means I need sticks, which means I need to work on this tree. But what I don't want to do is die. So let's do the grapevine first. Uh, and let's do the tree, because this is enough food to keep me alive for the moment. The cow doesn't produce quickly. Uh, let's sell. Okay, so that's gone. Daily life. Wood. Idea. Outhouse. One plank, one poop, one villager. Okay. Use it to get rid of poop. Yeah, that makes sense to me. Uh, I need soil. Oh no, I can put a stick in poo to grow to grow another tree. This is tense. I might die here. I could just like straight up die. I wonder what happens. Do I go back to my old world? Or do I just die? Hmm, I don't know. Put that in there. I guess he should be working on the grapevine. This is just an all new layer of intensity all of a sudden. <laughs> Sell that. Get another daily light. Oh, nope. Okay, so we've got some milk. I just desperately need this cow to produce some poo. Otherwise I'll just straight up die. This is a bit like the minimalist mod, actually, that Lopidav made. Um, except... I don't know what the stakes are or anything. <laughs> so this is a DLC. This is some DLC. Uh, open the back. Have three poop ideas. Okay, so I've still got all my ideas stuff, which is handy. Outhouse, room, or world of death. Okay. So I can still make all the cool stuff that I had in the in the previous one. I'm just hoping that if this guy doesn't make it, um, we go back to the old world. I guess I just wait to see if the cow poos. I sure hope it does. Feed villagers. How many of these grapes are you going to eat? Okay, I've got villager poo. Interesting. So this does give me a new kind of set of options. Let's plant one grape. One stick. Nope, that doesn't work. Alright. Nope, that doesn't work. Wood. So this just piles up uh, and doesn't not work as fertilizer. Interesting. Right, I desperately need to make that outhouse in that case, otherwise he's going to get poorly. One blank, one poop. So I didn't want to make the stick. Right, better sell that. Right, animal cage, yep. Yeah. Get you in there. Yeah, because the cow alone can't produce enough milk in the animal cage to feed my villager, I don't think. That apple's good, that's good. Okay, make a plank, please. And what is it? One plank and one poop. Yeah. It's good that it's just one plank. Grape and apple. No, don't combine, please. Oh no, let's see what that makes. Might make some juice that gives me more uh, food points potentially plank poop oh it's not village it's not poop it's villager poop great uh, let's get him in the rock then and we'll have to just use this stone I wonder if the portal shows up for this one yeah fruit salad's going to keep me fed for a while that's good uh, 
All right, let's get you working on that. I just think I need to, uh, yeah. How do I? How am I going to get an animal? An idea: cow, grape, vine, rock, stone, tree, wood. I need to get an animal that will provide poop. And I'm not too sure how to do that. So in the meantime, I guess we'll just make sticks. And hope my guy doesn't get sick, doesn't get ill. Let's make another animal cage. Just put this in the fire, maybe. Finally, got some poop. Oh, and also my, yeah, my villager can grow up and die, so that's... Excuse me, uh, that's interesting, yeah. Right, plank and poop, villager. Got the outhouse on the go. Quest completed, have three poop. <laughs> that's funny. Hmm. Build a lumber camp, okay, right. Uh, ideas. So this fruit salad should actually keep me fed for a while. Happy birthday. Oh, it doesn't take long then. Right. Wisdom of life. New pack unlock. Wisdom of life pack is now available. Oh, I see how it progresses. Right, so first things first, we pop the villager poop in the outhouse. So we might actually need more than one. Let's see what the rate is that they get got rid of. And our next bit of poop will plant a tree, I think. Okay, we have a tree there, that's good. And I won't make another animal cage till I have another animal. I think that's the way forward. And then I can combine them to make an animal pen. But yeah, it looks like more outhouses is kind of the way. Five undiscovered cards, grapevine, rock spring, and tree. Okay. I want a campfire. How do I make a campfire again? It's been a while. Uh, a stick and a flint. Okay. So in fact, let's not make a plank there. Let's make a stick. And then lumber camp. Three wood, one stone. Oh, I'm flip-flopping around, but it's a whole new game mode, so you know, you know how these things are. I feel like the one house is all right while I've got one villager, actually, looking at the state of things. Plenty of milk being produced, that's good. So I don't have to worry about hunger. Just growing old. Get a second villager. Hmm. I suppose just keep buying packs, that's how to get a second villager. Cool, got me a lumber camp, that's infinite money sorted. Alright. all the poo cleared away so at least we're not going to get sick let's turn that into a stick to get money we'll buy a wisdom of life pack shortly cool the outhouse is now empty that's great just need to make two sticks and then I can buy this pack Looks like some good cards come out of this one, and hopefully my second villager will as well. It's funny, I put all that energy into uh, arming up all those swordsmen and stuff, and, and now I'm just here, kind of starting all over again. You stay over there, Curse of Death. Okay, stick, sell, lumber camp, wisdom of life. I could even sell a couple of milks, to be honest, because I've got a lot of food there. Right, idea. Herbal tea. Herbs and water and campfire makes you feel better. Alright, well, that's nice, but not, I guess not an immediate issue. Here's some herbs. I want, um, I want another wisdom of life thing. 
Cool, sell that. Some spring water. Uh, oh, I have a poop. Okay. Uh, what can I what can I plant in there? Can I plant herbs? All right, let's feed him up. A new villager. A lonely villager decided to settle in your village. Crack him. Make a baby before it's too late. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the wording of that is very silly. Uh, house. Uh, okay, two wood, one stone, one villager. All right. Pop those in the outhouse. Okay, so we've got a bit of a sense of how this is working. What I think I'm going to do is wrap the episode up here and uh, bring it back and the next target will be to make a house for these two. So um, thanks very much. If you uh, enjoyed this video please uh, consider leaving me a like and leave any comments you have about the uh, cursed world I've just unlocked. Um, if I've done anything wrong, as always, please tell me. <laughs> I always feel like I'm just blundering into these situations uh, blindly and it's it's quite fun to do that. Um, if you're interested, we have a Discord server uh, where we chat Stacklands and lots of other games that I'm covering and all of that. Um, you can find a link to that in the uh, episode description here. Um, and uh, without further ado, wherever you are in the world, have a lovely evening or morning or afternoon and I will see you next time. Bye for now. <laughs>